Coming soon to own on video cassette. The wonderful thing about Tiggers is Tiggers are wonderful things. They're Bounce along with Tigger and all his friends from the Hundred Acre Woods. <laughs> including songs from the Tigger movie. Disney's Sing a Song with Tigger. Coming to video March 7th. Now available to own on video cassette. Come join your favorite bear, Winnie the Pooh, in a warm and whimsical world of discovery with four delightful video collections. Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh, Willy Billy Silly Old Bear. First, there's storybook classics, four wonderful videos based on A.A. Milne's original Pooh stories. It makes you feel just great! You'll see. Plus, there's five Pooh friendship videos. Get close to all your favorite friends from the Hundred Acre Wood and see how they care for each other. You're a real friend. And Pooh Playtime with five play-along fun videos. Ah, it's playtime, is it? <laughs> Full of laughter, warm feelings, and imagination. And you'll also love the five special Pooh learning videos with loving lessons on growing up, like how to share. Why, thank you, Biglet. Bring home all these delightful Winnie the Pooh videos. Hooray! Be sure to collect them all. Yeah, got your number deal. From Walt Disney Home Video. Exactly. <laughs> For everyone who's loved the timeless Madeline stories comes a brand new adventure about 12 little girls who live in a house all covered with vines. Disney presents Madeline's first feature-length animated movie. How wonderful! With five all-new songs. We can sing, we can dance. It's Madeline Lost in Paris, now on video. Be sure to catch all the fun and excitement on the Disney Channel. Stop by Playhouse Disney. It's Disney's new place for preschoolers. Bear teaches our kids to share and care. When our son watches out of the box, he learns by doing. With Bear in the Big Blue House, out of the box, and many more, Playhouse Disney is the stop for preschoolers, too. Introducing Playhouse Disney, where learning is powered by imagination every morning on Disney Channel. And now, our feature presentation. This could be the room of any small boy, but it happens to belong to Christopher Robin. Like most small boys, Christopher Robin has many stuffed animal friends. And together, they had many remarkable adventures in an enchanted place called the Hundred Acre Wood. Now his best friend is a certain little bear. And one of the grandest of their many grand adventures began around and about this day. A most delightful time of candies and cards. A day of Valentine's. <laughs> but happy as it was, the day brought with it a certain uncertainty. For this was also a time of change. And change does not come easily for some bears especially a bear named Winnie the Pooh. Christopher? Robin? Bola. He is always here, except for those occasions when he isn't, <laughs> which must mean he is <gasps> elsewhere. Piglet! Piglet!
Piglet, are you there? Or thereabout? Oh, oh, no, Pooh. I, I mean, uh, yes, Pooh. I, I mean, uh, oh, perhaps I'll be in later. Oops. Uh, 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 oh, dear. Dear, dear, dear. Have you seen Christopher Robin this morning? Oh, no, Pooh Bear. Not, not, not this morning. Oh, oh, or the morning before. Or oh, oh, the afternoon after the day before. Yes, it's true. He hasn't been by much at all lately, has he? I do wonder what might be the matter. Perhaps he's busy with something? Uh, maybe a surprise? Maybe. Maybe not. Depending. On what? Yes, on what? And what is it that you have there, Piglet? Uh, where? Uh, I, I mean, uh, where? I, 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 I don't seem to see anything. <laughs> there. This? Oh, oh this. <laughs> well, I, uh, I was making a Valentine's card, Pooh Bear, for you. Oh, that's quite nice of you, Piglet. But Valentine's is until tomorrow. You mean Valentine's falls on tomorrow this year? Well, oh, perhaps that is what Christopher Robin is up to. He must be making Valentine's for us all. And so Pooh and his friends went to find the boy. But what they found was very strange indeed. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I beg your pardon. What do we see? Oh, what's happening now? Ooh, would you take a look at that? What is it? What's he doing? Oh, my. Look now. Did you ever see such a thing? What? Such a thing as what? By dingy, he's writing something. Um, which particular something is he writing? Dear. <clears throat> he's writing to a deer. I bet you a buck he's fawning over some dough. <laughs> uh, more letters. Uh, w. I. N. Oh, well, what could it be? It's your name. He's spelling W-I-N-N, uh, the poo. <clears throat> oh, well, that's how I spell it, too. Dear Winifred. Wi Winifred? Winifred. Winnie to who? Winnie Fred. But what precisely is a Winifred exactly? A uh, Winifred, my dear friend, is... A girl. A girl? A girl. A girl? Or what? A girl. It's like a boy, only uh, not, uh, if you see what I mean. Oh. <laughs> no. Girls are like boys, except they're quite different. And even their differences are not the same. A boy sputters and squats, a girl potters and cleans. And each wants to say what the other one means, uh, so to speak. Girls are like boys, except they're quite different. Because of their differences, each is unique. A girl sees what she likes, a boy likes what he sees. He ruffles her feathers. She wobbles his knees. Uh, any questions, please? In some certain way, a boy looks at a girl. A girl looks at a boy in a similar way. A girl and a boy. Well, what more can I say? They're as different as dawn is to morning each day. They're really quite different in every way. But... Does that mean Christopher Robin will no longer be interested in us? Oh, Piffle, don't you understand? Christopher Robin's been bitten by a smitten. Its bite can cause love sickness. <gasps> well, then we must get him to a doctor. Oh, my dear bear, the smitten is merely a member of the love bug family. Oh, dear, 
Whatever shall we do? We must proceed with caution. Love sickness, yes, so I've heard, is very serious and highly catching. Then we gotta do something and do it fast. I got it! We gotta go and get another smitten to unsmite him. Nonsense, Tigger. That's absurd. That's ridiculous. That's, that's, hey, that's not a bad idea. If a second smitten smites him, it should cancel the first. Well, then we shall get him one. Let's go. Easy, poor boy. Not so fast. If you want to snare a smitten, the first thing you need is bait. <laughs> Picture perfecto! But, Tigger, where is the bait? You're right there, buddy bear! What self-respecting smitten could resist the lovely young lad standing on a hilltop holding a bouquet of forget-me-nots? Isn't that hilltop an anthill top? Oh, this is dear! No matter. Them forget-me-nots is poison ivy. <laughs> it's the best I could do on short notice. Oh, bother. Somebody or something has found my honey. Oh, my. I've never seen such a strange and peculiar whatever it is. You don't suppose it's a... <gasps> could it be the... The, the Smitten! Smitten. Oh, no! It's going! It's going! It's gone! We must find it, or Christopher Robin will never again be as he was. And off they went in search of the creature. And they searched. And they searched. Until at last, they found themselves deep in the unknown heart of the Hundred Acre Wood. Ooh. Oh, it's almost Valentine's, and I don't think we shall ever find this smitten. Why, it could be in most any part of anywhere. Hope these sm smittens aren't f f fierce creatures. <laughs> ah, oh, smittens are monsters. <laughs> Thingies, all right. One bite and and and, uh, and uh, uh, I don't want to talk about it. It's too all fired awful. <laughs> oh, but why? What happens when the love bug? Bites. You feel a little itch. You scratch and scratch and scratch it, but the itch becomes a twitch. When the smit done smites, everything's a blur. Topsy turns out turvy, and you isn't what you were. When, when the love bug smites, smites, you shake in disbelief. Your head gets all baroony with humongous hairy teeth. When the smit done bites, you make blibbering, blabbering sounds. You get all woogly woogly. Smashing, crashing all around. When the light takes flight, you go screaming through the wood. I'm not quite sure what happens, but it can't be very good. Oh, when the love b -b bug b -b bites. <gasps> look, look. It's him. Uh, him, Vic. I, I mean, uh, follow that smitten. I almost go. Oh. Oh, there. Now, Pooh Bear, wait. Don't go running off and. Oh, my. No. This way, everyone. 
But who, who, which way is this way? That way is this way. No way! It's that way! The one thing we know is nobody knows. Oh! Do, 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 do. I have it! Now Christopher Robin will be quite all right. Look, Piglet. <laughs> Rabbit. Tigger. Golfer. Christopher Robin were here to show us the way, but he is not, and I'm afraid we are very lost. Don't worry, piglet old pal. <laughs> we'll find our way. Just keep a tight hold of... <laughs> what was that? <laughs> <laughs> Being all by their lonely lonesomes is not something Tigger's like best. Whoa! A winking and a blinking. It is a smitten, isn't it? Oh, whatever it is, it it brought us out of the dark and back together. Yeah, the smitten shining its light on all of us. He certainly is. And now we can get this back to Christopher Robin, so as Christopher Robin can get back to being Christopher Robin. <laughs> and then he can get back to being with us. I've been looking everywhere. Where have you all been? <laughs> Where haven't we been? Go on, Pooh. Debug the boy. Yes, Christopher. There's something I wanted to show you, all of you. Go on, buddy bear, let him have it. I made this card for a, well, a friend, a new friend. And I wonder, what do you think of it? Oh, it's very nice indeed. Do you suppose she'll like it? Oh, certainly. Uh, no doubt. You betcha. <laughs> totally. Yep. I am most sure of it. Oh, I'm awfully glad to hear that. Well, what are you waiting for? How 
never gonna get the kid back to his old self. Oh, why did you let it go? Because Christopher Robin is happy as he is. And I shouldn't want it any other way. This is the saddest happy Valentine's I can recall. from you. <laughs> is it really for me, Christopher? It really is. But... But I... But what, Pooh? But we thought you found a... a new friend. Oh, Pooh. There's a place right here And it's really rather small but this rather small place knows the grandest thing of all. It knows when understanding can be hard to understand. It knows that words aren't needed when you take somebody's hand. Like mine. It knows that you are with me in everything I do. <laughs> it's that special corner of my heart, the place that I call Pooh. Oh, Christopher. There are places in the heart that always know a friend. In good and glad and sad times, the heart remembers them. There are new friends yet to meet. There's a place for them to start. But old friends always keep them places in the heart. Old friends like us. Oh, Pooh. I care just as much about you as I always have. Yes, I thought that too. <laughs> Still, it's very nice to hear it said. <laughs> Silly old bear. There are places in the heart that always know a friend. In good and glad and sad times, the heart remembers them. There are new friends yet to meet. There's a place for them to start, but old friends always keep them. Places in the heart. And so as winter changes into spring, which changes into summer, they're things which go on forever unchanging. Such as the way a certain boy cares for a certain bear. And we will know, for as long as we care to remember, that somewhere in that enchanted place on top of the forest, a boy and his bear will always be playing.